So you know why daddy put this on here? We put it all in tight together so it can burn all together at once. You know, I always tell people that my boy saved my life. I become a, a father who has tried to do all the right things by not doing the things that didn't feel good to me as a kid. When I graduated from high school, when I was in the California Youth Authority and I had just turned 18, a guy who was from Ghana walked up to me and he asked me, he said, do you know what your name means? And he said, your first name, Kasima, means to speak. And my middle name, Kahari, means warrior. And the more I started learning about my history and my culture and the folks that fight outside of you know, the folks that you learn about in elementary school who seem to be like just everyday people that we don't talk about, like that could be somebody in my family. That could be me. Remember when I started at the uh, Community Coalition and they asked me to be a part of this uh, street action team. Hey, Ms. Rachel, how you doing today? How are you doing? doing it's good to see. We'd be out knocking on doors and you know talking to people, organizing and figuring out how to get people to become members of the organization. As we started to learn those things, I started to get this sense of identity. Like I'm like, what is this? Like I'm starting to feel comfortable with who I am. It made me want to be more involved. It made me want to stand up for my community, for my people in any way possible. Um, and to do the same by passing this down, what I was learning to my children so that they started to understand what it meant to be active in your communities, to be active in politics, and to know your history, and that just knowing your history may not be enough. So I want to take the Survival Fund grant, and I want to show my boys what it means to invest. Um, in themselves and in themselves would be investing in owning our own property and so starting with me so that they understand that hey you know this is what my dad said and this is what it meant to him hmm? let me talk about you what was the first thing you said you wanted to get you want to get your own house right i want my children to be invested in their community and if they can find a space um, that they can own in their own community and not have to measure their success by how far they get away from their community, I would love for that to be able to happen because I think that the importance is us staying in our communities and fighting it to make it a better place.